Poppy Sunkey Squad. It is your girl, K to the motherfucking Benz, the Sunkey Squad, and I'm back with another bitty to the O. Brown skin, pretty brown eyes, slim waist, but her hips kind of wide, thick thighs. She about five five or about five six. Pretty tits and high legs cross when she sit. Hair was hanging by the inch, then she cut it off. Eyebrows on fleek, can't rub it off. No pencil, trap music in the Benz coupe. Put the top. Down. Today's video is going to be not necessarily a haul, but I guess an unboxing video because I finally received one of my she inboxes or packages, whatever. Listen, this thing took me forever. It was express and it didn't even come express. I was cheese because I paid duties for no reason. But anyways, the stuff that I got in the box is like some home decor as well as like a few pieces of clothing. So we gonna get into this. If you did not check out my pretty little thing channel, make sure you guys go check that out. Link will be down below. I do have a lot of cute finds and things in there as well that you guys might like. So make sure you guys check it out. But let's get into this video. So this is the box it came in. It got shipped through DHL. I ordered three sweaters, shorts, and like this top. And then I ordered a bed sheet, I think. I can't even remember at this point. Uh, I always see the packaging in people's hauls, but I'm very excited to have it myself. So this is basically the packaging of their products. It's in like its own bag, which I like because it's individualized. So I got a burgundy yellow and orange sweater from them just because I love that baggy type of feel like the oversized hoodie with sneakers flex. So this is sweater number one. I got this in a size small. Okay, smells like, doesn't smell bad, but this is item one. And literally, the other sweaters are the same fit, uh, just different colors, just because why not have variety? Ooh, I love bright colors on melanin, no one understands, so I got a yellow. Bitch, <laughs> we come in like sunshine in the summertime, like what's good? Ugh, don't play with me, so we got this one. Same pullover hoodie, and then we got orange because who doesn't love orange? And I actually have like nothing orange, and I want to start wearing orange more in the summertime. So, oh, child, don't play with me. And then we got this orange one. So they're honestly just pretty basic stuff. So next, what we got is a pair of shorts and this top. Whoa, why does this look so big? This is my first time actually getting like clothes from them, I guess you could say. So I don't really know how it's supposed to fit. I got these shorts. And I'm very excited because these look really big. I don't know, my hips are 42, like I said in my POT haul, and my waist is very tiny. But I like the fact that there's rips. I really don't have jean shorts because all the shorts literally just right up in my cooch, and it's not cute, and it's very uncomfortable. So I got that, and then I got this, like, snakeskin top. I will leave all the links down below for you guys in case you guys did want them. And it's just like this wraparound shirt with the string or whatever so we're gonna try this on i'm actually gonna try it on together because i feel like it'll be a cute outfit so this is the outfit i honestly love this shirt only thing is that it does feel kind of loose a bit i did get a small but i like the fact that i could tie it up a lot my waist still needs some work these are the shorts they are fitted only thing i don't like is the bagginess like what is this i hate when this happens with shorts like it is so irritating but like the back it's not the worst you know, like I still have my booties there. I just wish the front wasn't like this. I feel like they could be high waisted. I just need to lose my stomach and my punch. But other than that, it is pretty cute. I like it. I love these shorts just for the simple fact that I don't own shorts like these. It's one of those tops that you have to constantly, I feel like, keep pulling up. But other than that, it is pretty cute. And for the price of both items, I think they're steel and they are pretty comfy as well. And they do feel breathable as well. So. So for the home decor, it wasn't really much. I got literally these black sheets for my bed because I want something that doesn't necessarily stain. I got it in a queen size. So it comes with the sheet itself. I don't want to unravel it because it's so neatly packed. But supposedly it comes with the sheet and two pillowcases. I then got these like vines, I guess, for my room. It also comes with lights because for my room aesthetic, I'm trying to go green. I'm trying to have like that earthy, natural type of vibe going on. So I got these. I'm nervous opening it because I'm not even using it yet. That's my thing. So I need to put batteries in it, but these are basically the vines. Um, I can't remember how long they were. Let me check. It is two meters long, um, and it was 6.30. The sweaters each were like around 20 bucks. The shirt was eight bucks. Shorts were around 24, and the sheet was 20 bucks because sheets are so expensive. I always forget to tell you guys the prices once I show you guys the item, but everything will be down below anyways. This has to be my favorite purchase. They're basically, sat it's like a satin duvet cover with obviously the pillowcases to match. And it's just like, this makes me feel like I'm a goddess in my bed. Like, it just looks so green, so cute. <gasps> so basically, this is, oh, it's so cute. So, this is, oh my god. So 
this is the satin sheet. Got this set for 40 bucks. It doesn't come with a duvet cover, so you do have to buy it yourself. I think I have a duvet cover in the basement, but I can't remember. But I feel like for the material, like it doesn't even feel cheap. Like this looks expensive and it feels motherfucking expensive. Like, and I also know silk is good for hair as well as your skin, so I, that's why I also got it as well. But um, yeah, guys. So this is basically how the material looks. So imagine literally putting your head on this, right, and covering yourself in silk. What? Don't play with me. Okay, so this is literally the sheets. Okay, in case you guys wanted to know, I'm not gonna unpackage the whole thing just because I'm not setting up my bed. But when I do decorate my room, I'm gonna be doing vlogs as well, so I might start that soon because all my stuff should be in by next week. And the last items I got were fairy lights. Listen, fairy lights online is so expensive, and when I found them here, I said I'm getting. I'm confused because. It was basically five bucks for four meters. I just don't understand how it's supposed to light up if there is no switch. Do I think I have to use like a block for it for like your iPhone or something? Let's just see because I'm confused. Like I'm really lost. Ooh. Usually I see these things and like battery operated, but I guess not this guy. Okay, so let's test this out with a block. Okay. They work. So basically you need a block to use these, but they didn't say that in the description. So that's friggin' annoying. Cause now I need three blocks, three blood clot blocks for this light when it didn't even just want to come with the battery. That's what it didn't say though. It didn't say it was USB operated. Let me see to make sure I'm not tripping out. Okay, so in the comments, it was saying basically you need the plug for USB or USB plug, but I didn't look at the comments because I'm just like, I see five star ratings, I'm gonna get it. So, I just wish they said you needed a plug so that it would have saved me time and energy because I could have ordered it all at the same time. But other than that, like for the price, like these things are long. So basically, if you get these fairy lights, make sure you have a USB port or like a block or whatever to charge it up because they don't tell you that at all. But other than that, I feel like these would be very cute. I'm literally gonna put it on this wall. You guys are gonna see me decorate my room, so make sure you guys stay tuned because my ideas are great. If you hear the background, I'm so sorry. My sister and my mom are upstairs, so it's okay. It is what it is. I can't do anything about that. But that is the end of today's video. I know it was pretty quick, pretty simple, pretty basic, but I just wanted to show you guys my items. I will be expecting another Shein big box. I don't know when because basically, I don't know what's going on. I'm waiting. It's in Canada. I'm literally waiting for it to be shipped to my door so stay tuned for that because that is a huge channel i got like 20 plus items spent like 300 plus dollars on that so it's huge so make sure you guys stay tuned because i have a lot of cute finds in there but other than that hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys wanted me to do anything specific make sure you guys comment that down below make sure you guys hit that like button type in that comment tuxedo Make sure you guys hit that like button, type in that comment, and hit that subscribe button with the bell to know when I post. It is your girl, Kate to the motherfucking Ben, and I'll see you guys in my next video.